In this short video we're going to look at a summary of the weather during June. This mainly uses infrared satellite imagery which looks at temperature and shows all types of cloud. The whiter the cloud, the colder and higher it is in the atmosphere. June's weather was dominated by low pressure over or close to the UK with associated weather fronts. There were rather cold days with large rainfall totals and strong winds early in the month. It was also the wettest June on record since 1910 and equal wettest June in England and Wales since 1766. We'll now have a look at some key weather events during the month. Unsettled conditions on the 3rd during the Diamond Jubilee celebrations on the Thames brought some persistent wet weather. From the 7th to the 9th there was stormy weather for southern England and South Wales which resulted in difficult driving conditions and significant flooding in Wales, especially across Aberystwyth. There was more prolonged and heavy rain on the 11th for southeast and central southern England. This was a shallow but active depression that caused flooding and disruption. Further rainfall on the 21st caused waterlogged grounds for the Isle of Wight festival as persistent rain moved in. You can see from this satellite imagery the bands of shower circulating around the low. The 22nd also saw flooding across parts of Lancashire, Cumbria and Yorkshire with 88.6mm of rain recorded at Keswick in Cumbria. The most widespread and serious flooding was on the 28th, with the Midlands, North East England, Northern Ireland and Southern Scotland affected. During this period there were frequent lightning and hail events. This satellite imagery shows where lightning occurred during that period. The red and orange crosses show where lightning was occurred. More than 111,000 lightning strokes were detected across Europe, with more than 1,000 detected over the UK in a five-minute period during the peak of activity. You can find monthly climate summaries under the Weather tab on our website.